since I'm one of the individuals who was blogging that Trump was going to win the 2016 election hands down, fucking not a problem at all, and that it was going to happen, <clears throat> you might want to listen to what I'm about to say. Obviously, you don't have to. You can just press pause. You can stop. You can like go to some other podcast. Some, some, some will. You know, they're just like, fuck you, dude. For those who stay, by the way, thank you for tuning in. I'll say this. These people who are running for office against Donald Trump right now, 2019 going into 2020, they are delusional idiots. All of them. Every fucking one of them. I wouldn't want to waste my money like that. I wouldn't want to have my reputation as a so-called Democrat. I'm not a Democrat. I'm saying in the case of Democrats. These Democrats who tout themselves as being so fucking educated and so smart and so knowledgeable and so knowing and so pithy and so whatever the fuck they believe themselves to be with their own self-aggrandizement. Yeah, I know that's redundant. Own self. Same thing. Aggrandizement. I said it for emphasis. I'm a master of English and grammar, so I break fucking rules like that because I want you to know that they're about self, they're about aggrandizement, they're about all of their own shit. That is total fantasy shit. It's a fable. And in their egos, they have to run against someone who they know they cannot fucking beat. They think they're on some David and Goliath shit. They're fucking foolish, man. They're stupid. They're not just stupid. Let's let's dissect and analyze how stupid these people actually are. Look at Bernie Sa- uh, Sanders. Look at Kamala Harris. Fucking idiots. Delusional as fuck. Just fucking out of their minds. Wacky, silly, goofy, delusional. Fucking so lofty and arrogant. Really? Bernie... Like, dude, have you not figured out you do not have a chance to beat Donald Trump? And neither do you, Joe Biden. You don't need, dude, you don't even have a chance in a fucking zillion eons, Mr. Biden, to beat Donald. Why are these fuckers running for office? Why? Ego. They can't win. It's not going to be some slim, tiny, small, minuscule, minute margin by which Mr. Donald Trump, the current president, our current president wins re-election, it's going to be by a motherfucking landslide. These these so-called analysts are funny jokes. This country right now, man, is almost like a cartoon. These so-called analysts, these so-called radio show, these liberal left-leaning leftist fucking drive-by media punks, these fucking rejects, they're on CNN when they should be back in school. They all need to go back to fucking school because whatever school they went to failed them. Okay, these people are failures. They're lousy, bum-ass failures in life. They talk about Donald Trump is a toddler. They're fucking infantile. They themselves are absolutely infantile. Big-ass, grown, infant children in adult bodies. That's the, that's the, de, that's the devolution. De-evolution. I know the word is devolution, but I like to say de-evolved. Because you have fucking jakes, stupid, monkey chimp people, primitive humans, that is. They are. And they like to talk about evolution. When in fact, I'm 100% certain because I know there's no fucking such thing as evolution. I don't give a fuck if you're a biologist. I don't give a fuck if you're an astrobiologist. I don't give a fuck if you're a so-called scientist. There's no such thing as evolution, motherfucker. So these people who like to use the word evolve, evolution, I like to throw it back at them. Because that's how medieval and how dumb they are. 
So I like to use the word de-evolve, even though the actual word is devolve, devolution. These de-evolved primitives that have gone backwards, man, these reprobate spastics, these fucking inbreds, these ingrates, these bad DNA broken system, sludge cesspools, these reprehensible ooze, ooze pools of ooze, Sludge, goop, these fucking goobers, these goop, sludge, cesspool, parasites, they think they're so fucking smart. They obviously didn't learn their lesson from from one of their fallen leaders, politically fallen leaders, Hillary Clinton. Yeah, and the loser Hussein, who ran amok in government as... As failed president. They didn't learn. So now they're going to try to dial it up. As opposed to dialing it back. Everything they're doing is going to backfire on them. Why even run for president when you know that you're a loser? Like, you doing it for kicks at this point? Because if you are, I'm not going to pay attention to you. I'm not like Fox News It's going to be like, this person's talking about this. This liberal idiot said this. This liberal primitive said this. This fucking monkey chimp person said this. This stupid baboon buffoon said this. I don't give a fuck what they said. Fox, who gives a shit what liberal fucking morons say? Who gives a shit what these stupid fucking baboon ass imbeciles say? They're fucking circus clowns. They're jokes. They're clown jokes. They're clown stooges. They're fucking rat snakes. Fuck these jakes. These snakes. These rodents. These rats. These parasites. Fuck them all. Why do you want to keep telling people on, keep posting, writing, blogging, typing on Fox News? AOC said this. AOC said that. AOC said this. AOC said that. Who gives a fucking shit? She's just another stupid fucking idiot moron. You're going to keep posting what idiot morons say instead of what else you could post about, blog about, talk about? Why don't we talk about what conservatives say? Why don't we talk about what conservatives say? Why don't we talk about what conservatives say? And why don't we just ignore motherfuckers on the left, in in the extreme left media, on the radical left? Why don't we just ignore those pieces of fucking trash. You ever thought about that, Fox? Huh? You ever thought about that? They can't fucking win. So why do you even give a shit what they're talking about? I tuned out a long time ago. 